Okay guys, what is happening and welcome to Cake and Crypto. In today's video, we are going to speak about Hong Kong and my thoughts about it and I'll explain why this is bullish news. However, before I start the video, I just want to start off by saying this content is not made for financial advice. This content is made for educational and entertainment purposes only. Please understand that you are responsible for your own trades. Trades can add 10x, 100x, or go to zero. You are responsible for your own trades. So if it goes south, you're blaming yourself. Us guys, I do not run ads on the channel. However, I always do plug my Patreon. What the Patreon is, guys, access to my buy and sell alerts, all my tone calls, all my coin alerts, and you have access to all my chart alerts. Everything is in the Telegram. Also, guys, I do have a sister project called The Code Portal. And what that is, is access to, um, basically, it's me um, self-learning, Web app, web development, app development, and blockchain development, so I can break down these projects not just from a analysis chart analysis view or a you know a a fundamentals view, but I could also break this down from a cold view. Okay, so if you are serious about your cryptocurrency career, come join the Patreon. Right, guys, let's talk about Hong Kong. But first of all, let's talk about the market. The market is having a red day today. Um. Yeah, it's just going sideways. It always, ha it always has been. And, you know, we're just waiting for some sort of big news to happen. And Hong Kong has gone ahead and regulated cryptocurrency. And this will happen because what's going on in today's age is that, like, for example, Binance packed its bags yesterday. Well, not yesterday specifically. And it decided to leave Canada because Canada, um, Canada UK, all these places are trying to regulate cryptocurrency and the whole point of cryptocurrency is that it's unregulated you can't regulate cryptocurrency it defeats the purpose right so if you're gonna regulate cryptocurrency we might as well go back to the banking system the whole point of cryptocurrency is to destroy the banking system right and obviously these countries ain't gonna like that there's some countries who ain't even allowing cryptocurrencies full stop okay if you have cryptocurrencies in your bank you're going to prison okay however in the uk it's a bit more lenient lenient canada's not allowed it However, there are places that will open up in the world, like Hong Kong, and I've spoke about this before, um, about me um, speaking about Dubai a lot, because Dubai, you're allowed to go and withdraw your cryptocurrency, no questions asked, it's your crypto, you own it, it's your asset, it's your God-given right, okay, and you can go spend it in, in Dubai tax-free, and what happens in this world is that if you whack a mole in one country, what's going to happen is the billionaires and the millionaires in crypto will just move why because they've got the asset to move <laughs> it's very simple they're not going to tell you oh i'm going to dubai to withdraw no they're just going to move there and then withdraw it so this is what's going to happen in the world because there will be some countries like hong kong like dubai and um, that will just say listen 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 okay we are just going to allow crypto because we understand that the people that you've banned doing crypto will just want to come to us and what will happen to their to their places? The economy will boom, okay? So it's either you get on board with it or you try and regulate it. UK are coming out with their own stable cryptocurrency. Canada's already started um, and things like that, okay? So, and, and you can also go to Puerto Rico, I believe, to withdraw your cryptocurrency. And, you know, so that's it. So once you do six, seven figures, yeah, if you withdraw that stuff in the UK, you'll get attacked 40%, 40%. What, what, why 40? Why Why not 42? <laughs> right? It's just because the UK likes taxing people and it is what it is, okay? And taxes are fine. Always pay your taxes, guys. But in cryptocurrency, it's a bit It's a bit of a bully. You know what I mean? Um, so it's a bit insane. So that's my honest thoughts about Hong Kong and uh, regulating. I predict more countries will adopt cryptocurrency. Um, and I believe the ones that do will just have a economic boom. That's what I honestly predict. And Hong Kong adopting adopting cryptocurrency is phenomenal it is phenomenal because like i'm like yeah i want to go hong kong now i've never wanted to go hong kong in my entire life but just because they've done this i'm like telling my wife let's go hong kong <laughs> right so so point is yeah you know i'm really happy about these countries and obviously certain countries will try and control um but that just is the name of the game okay you cannot kill cryptocurrency unless all countries across the world do it right but all countries won't, okay? Because there isn't one source of power out there. There isn't just one guy at the top of this pyramid. No, there's a bunch of pyramids, and there's a people. There's people at the top of each pyramid trying to climb to the pyramid, okay? And and it will just never be. So crypto will never die. Crypto will always evolve, and especially with the AI um, destroying, you know, um, 
you know, like you can have like deep fakes of people's voices, images. You don't know who's who anymore. I can literally generate an image of me flying across the moon, okay? Like we're going to need a, a way to prove that people own certain things. And what are they going to turn to? They're going to turn to non-fungible tokens. They're going to turn to blockchain. Why? Because blockchain, you cannot fake evidence on the blockchain and it's decentralized, okay? So that's my honest thoughts about Hong Kong, um, you know, regulating, not regulating, allowing cryptocurrency and Canada. Look, Canada lost Binance, right? Canada will lose all the people that do crypto. And what will those people do? They will just move country. And that's the end of it, okay? So if you like this video, um, oh yeah, my, my conclusion about before I end the video is that's bullish, okay? It's gonna make cryptocurrency boom, okay? Right, guys, if you like the video, please make sure to like, share, and subscribe. Hit the bell notification for your daily updates. And guys, come join the Patreon if you say cryptocurrency career. And yeah, that's it for today. Until next time, until next episode, guys, I will speak to you soon. Take care and have a beautiful, blessed day.